side tires for showing the gun. Same thing for taking the street. And made contact with the jet dryer, which if you've never seen it, it is attached to the back of a truck. And it's dragged around the racetrack. The jet obviously used it to dry the speedway. But something broke because there was a shower of sparks behind Juan Pablo's car, a good three to four hundred feet first. Then it spun around and then made this impact. Slammed the head of that uh, jet dryer over there. So red flag, obviously, all of that material that has been swept out the banking. And now what we have is the front end loader that has arrived on the scene and is basically just working its way through what has accumulated on the apron. It's trying to load up the front. Matter of fact, guys with shovels are taking all this speedy drive and just heaving it in the front row, trying to load that up. And then they have to just do that. Get on. Well, they place the ties down, and then they've got another crew with push crews. Here they come now, the start finish line, and the green finally is back in the air. Here at the World Center of Racing, Matt Jensen, Greg Bimble, hook up in a draft in the outside lane, right across over from the main line.